A few changes to the manual S speed sheet here that I thought I'd run through. So what I did is I created this new tab where you can enter the um, pertinent information and it feeds whichever forms you're going to use. Um, so we'll just add some data here real quick and uh, show you how it works. So, mm -hmm. Um, I do already have it populated with the design conditions over here for my area, but uh, you could adjust those however you want. Um, let's see, I forgot to see what the load was on this project. Let me, let me get it pulled up. So our heating load is 28,837. Cooling, 12472. And the cooling sensible is 10,275. All right. I'll go back to our... Um, temp star page and find the um, model that we want to check here all right so let's see what form we need to use here looks like this one is correct you'll see up here at the top all this information gets pulled in so you can just use whichever form you want um, one of the main goals behind this is uh, i used to generate a spreadsheet for each piece of equipment i was trying to select but this will allow me to so you can see I typed in the name of this system here. And if I want to create another one that uses this same form and all the information, I can just duplicate the sheet, you know, rename it to something different and add my information here. But we'll quickly run through um, this and kind of give you a rundown of manual s i have done videos of this in the past but uh just thought i'd run through it here All right, so we're going to try this 525 CFM column. And so at 85 and 67 is... Then our sensible... Uh, now we have to do it with a 62 wet bulb, which would be this one. And we also have to do the same for the 95 temperature.
forgot here to change this to we are an air-to-air -air heat pump single speed mild or latent there we go so you'll see this system fails uh, just because we have such a low cooling load here um, However, uh, that's kind of beyond the scope of this video. I just wanted to kind of show you some of the features. Um, just to kind of finish this off, let's go ahead and add our heating capacities here as well. And our SEER information. So there you go. I will leave a link in the description below about uh, or how you can download this fixed version. Uh, it only works on iOS or Mac OS, um, but you can download um, from ACA the Excel versions. Thanks for watching.